Hey guys, what is up? Red Panda Mining here. How are you guys all doing? I hope you're all doing really well and having a really great day. In this video, this is the Radeon 7 profitability for the month of December. And you guys know that I was mining on NiceHash for the whole month, as I mentioned in the last video for this uh, Radeon 7 profitability. And let me tell you, I, I don't like it. I don't like it. And, but... I'm gonna give nice hash the benefit of the doubt and uh, I'll give you my reasonings for that later on but let me just show you here how much I've made on nice hash okay with this Radeon 7 and another thing another funny thing I forgot to mention is that I'm also mining with the CPU that's currently on with this Radeon 7 as well okay so technically I should be getting more profits but I really didn't. So let me let me show you in a second. So the 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 i five thirty five seventy k CPU, uh, which is mining uh, random X at the moment. So it's getting about one point four one kilohashes per second. Actually, we can just see right here, uh, almost fifteen hundred hashes per second on random X, and then on Ethereum we are getting about eighty eight to eighty nine mega hash. It was at eighty nine mega hash before, but now it's I think because I'm using the uh, window here and I'm and I'm remoted in it's dropped a little bit of mega hash here But you guys can see I've been using nice hash for about 30 days. I don't know if we can see the history and stats here I'm not quite sure how far back this goes a week day uh, Week let's see here. It is slow. Okay, there we go Okay, it looks like it only goes back a week, but it's really slow. Okay, but yeah, you guys can see it's, it's been mining every single day. And yeah, this is hilarious. Here's my payout, 0 0.0002081 BTC. Oh, this is, oh, group by day. Ah, okay, okay, let's see here. Group by day. Okay, so you guys can see each day I was making about... 0.00012877 so uh, 12,870 to 13,243 satoshis per day it ranges obviously it ranges per day depending on network difficulty whatever all that stuff um, okay so the whole month okay so from December 1st to December 31st we've mined BTC on NiceHash straight to Bit Bitcoin okay as of the price right now, the Bitcoin, as of making this video, is 7139 okay? Uh, actually, you guys might see this video on Sunday, so the price might change drastically uh, in, a, in a couple days. But we can see here, amount mined is 0 0.031611 Satoshis, okay? And this amounts to, in USD value, $20.99, and uh, hash rate was 89 Mega hash uh, wattage at the wall, okay, at the wall is 280 watts. So the CPU and the memory, motherboard, everything takes about f uh, 50 to 60 watts, and the GPU itself takes about 210 to 220 watts at the wall, okay. And uh, there, the wattage price for the whole rig is about $13.63 per month, okay. And then we have here the profits mined minus the wattage cost. So I did $20, uh, $21 minus 13.63 and we get $7.36. Uh, and then uh, the original price of the card, which costed 781 USD, 0.26 USD, and then plus the electrical costs. You guys can see here, plus electrical used since the inception of this card back in April 1st of 2019. We have garnered or paid now well, haven't paid, yeah, in fiat value, $910.46 in the negative. And I haven't sold any of the coins yet. As you guys heard, you hear hodling all the coins I like until enough to hit break even or when I feel it is a good time to sell to make, to take some profits. Pray for all, pray for altcoin season. So that's, uh, that's my chart here, my friends. And you guys can see my calculation for electrical cost here if you guys want to see uh, if you guys are new. Uh, I've been making these videos every single month since April, okay? So you guys can check and see those other videos if you'd like. Um, now, total, okay? I want to see, I want to show you guys the total amount of coins since I've mined with this Radeon 7 uh, since April 1st of 2019. You guys can see right here, okay? Ethereum Classic, 31.62. 
Monero, 0.8, uh, 1300 Callisto, 60 Vert coin, and now I have 0.003 Bitcoin from this Radeon 7 in the month of December. So, and then the total wallet, okay, the total wallet value of all those coins that I just mentioned here is now $208.11 USD. And that is if I sold everything as of making this video. And that's, uh, hey, I'm, I'm getting close. I'm getting pretty, no, I'm, I'm not kidding. This is, this is like, according to this stats here, this is like a few more months behind. But, but if these coins decide to go up like, I don't know, 10x, like if Ethereum Classic to, decides to go back to $40, I would probably be, probably be able to break even on uh, this GPU, just, just from this GPU mining its own coins. It, to be honest with you guys, I've already, I've already broken even, I've already got my money back from this card if I account my, my whole farm, okay? I'm not going to mention how much I make from my whole farm, but yeah, I've, I've already already ROI'd, break even, whatever term you guys like to uh, like to say, um, to get the, your return, your money back on uh, here. So yeah, I've already, I've already gotten my return on this, but theoretically, I'm doing this as a single card profitability thing, and I think this is a fun experiment to do anyway, uh, so you guys can see when we can actually uh, break even on this card. All right, so now I was mentioning before, okay, I was mentioning before that since I didn't uh, like the nice hash, like the amount of Bitcoin that I got in value, okay, $20.99, but that's indicative of the price of, let's see, the price of Bitcoin right now. I need the chart here. Let's go to, uh, uh, I, was on, I was looking up the Vertcoin price here, Bitcoin, okay, so Bitcoin, obviously 71, $71.36, the price is is pretty low it's come down let's see if we go back to let's just zoom in here so back so December let's see the price of Bitcoin has jumped yeah quite consider considerably 7500 wow I went all the way to 66 6600 uh, but now we're in the middle of 71 so obviously my outlook would change if the price of Bitcoin was up then then this would be a better look than what I've mined last month okay November in the month of November I was mining ethereum classic so obviously that looks better now uh, but a funny thing a funny thing is that ethereum classic price has gone up quite a bit actually so if you guys see here Ethereum Classic is four dollars and forty-one cents. My last profitability video I did in November, the price of Ethereum Classic was three dollars and ninety-three cents. So if I stuck with mining Ethereum Classic, I would probably be making definitely more at the end of this month of December. Okay, so, but obviously that changes. It totally depends. And you know another thing is that with Nice Hash, I know I was mining. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I, I I I am mining Ethereum on this, right? So, as you guys can see, I'm mining Ethereum on this on this rig, right? On NiceHash, but I'm not sure if NiceHash was mining, or you know, depending on their contracts, depending on what people are buying in terms of hash power, if it's ETHHash, which is the Dega Hashimoto algorithm, but it, uh, sorry, if it's Ethereum or Ethereum Classic. Okay, so there's 5.2 TerraHash right now on nice hash so whether this is on ethereum or ethereum classic i'm not sure uh, another funny thing is that the ethereum classic hash rate in december has gone up considerably so let's see december 12th we can see that the hash rate was 9.8 terahash and then we went up all the way the end of this year december 30th it's at 13.3 terahash per second so wow that's 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 a lot. That's a lot. But probably probably about good point thirty three, uh, thirty three percent rise. I guess uh, if that's a correct calculation. Yeah. If that accounts to, you know, the profitability of Ethereum going up and then Bitcoin also going down, then that's what happens uh, to this to this number here. But, you know, of course the wallet value will change every single day. It will never stay the same. So you guys know that. Uh, but I'll keep you guys updated and stuff on that. So my thoughts, am I going to stay on, high, on nice hash? No, I'm going to get off of it right now. I just pressed stop. I'm going to close this. I don't want to mine on nice hash anymore. I'm going to mine a new coin. Let's see here. Let's figure it out together here. Let's go to coin market cap. So 
I actually no, let's go to my sheet here. So uh, of all the five coins that I've mined so far, I obviously like Ethereum Classic more. Okay. Monero was all right, but now that's on random X, GPU mining is not good on Monero. Uh, Callisto is still ETH hash, so I can, I can mine Callisto, but I don't really think it's going to do that well in the future. Vertcoin, you know, Vertcoin was definitely a fun coin to mine, but the price of the coin has definitely come down quite a lot. Um, let's see here. So in the past months, I mined Vertcoin in October. It was worth $14 at the time. November, it went up to about $15. But now, the month of December, it has gone down drastically to $9, which obviously, it, it doesn't matter. If you believe in the coin, you like the coin, then that's all that matters. But, you know, I want to do this from a profitability standpoint. This, that's what I'm doing. So, I'm going to mine, uh, let's, just, let's just go back to Ethereum Classic. I think that's the best in terms of profitability for this, for this card to get the most out of it. Okay, so I'm going to do that. And uh, yeah, I think that's it, my friends. That's all I wanted to talk about. Let me know what you guys think. And uh, if, I, if I got the hash rate thing wrong, but also the Ethereum network hash rate has also gone, gone down quite a bit. Okay, so yeah, whether that the uh, rewards, obviously we're getting less because of the uh, difficulty bomb, but that should be changed now as the difficulty bomb has been delayed now. So um, yeah, we'll see. Okay, so I'm gonna I'm gonna go on back to Ethereum Classic for the month of January. So I'll see you guys at the end of January, and we will account how much coins, how much Ethereum Classic we have mined. So I'll see you guys in the next video. Let me know what you think. I appreciate you all for watching. All that good stuff. I'll see you in the next video. Have a good one, and peace out.